Okay, so that was fun. I spent almost an hour blabbering, blabbering on about fucking Gwent and shit, and I was not recording my voice at all because I'm an idiot. And it's been over a month since I recorded. So, we'll start again, I guess. You ever play Gwent, buddy? Up for a few rounds of Gwent, BB? Oh, with great pleasure, sir. Ready? Let's play. May the best man win. Do you wish to play against any particular faction, sir? Yeah, I'd like to play against your fucking mom. God damn it. Play as the Northern Realms, will you? As you wish. Would you prefer I use my strongest deck or a weaker one? <sighs> Let's see, I gotta start my... How am I gonna do this? Like I said, uh, if you watched the video I put up earlier, which I maybe I'll take it down, I don't fucking know what I'll do, but... I played for about 40 minutes of Gwent, and um, I had put a lot of my shitty cards back into my deck and tried to play it in the same mindset that I had my, when I first started out, and worked my way up to middle to strongest to show you the tactics you can use and whatnot, and I'm kind of annoyed and pissed off that it didn't record, so... I think I'll do middle of the road this time. Maybe a moderately strong deck. That should be fair. At your service, sir. Well then, let us play. Yes, let's play. Okay. Let me change my fucking leader card. Uh, destroy our enemy's strongest siege. And yeah, I'll just do that. Okay, so. cards. Because I'm mainly, I was making this for you, Sammy, but uh, like I said, I, I talked about all the stuff I was doing. I took out my hero cards. I took out a lot of the cards that were stronger and put in a bunch of my shitty fucking infantry cards, just because that's what when you tried to play sort of like that, but I'm a little pissed off now, so I think I might keep most of these, or some of them. I'll take out, um... I'll take out my Geralt card, because I don't think I got that till later in the game. I'll take out my... I'll take out the Alice card. I'll take out this idiot. And Philippa. And... Fuck. Um... Take out this stupid card. One, two. And I'll take out these, because these were like DLC kind of shit, so you're not going to have those in your first plan. You're also not going to have a lot of spy cards. I think you might have one. You're not going to have all these fucking hero cards either. You're not going to have this mysterious elf. The rest all. Now, you probably aren't going to have this. Well, shit, fuck it. Let's just do this. Alright, so now I'm going to add. Shitty cards. Because that's what you got, Sammy. Stupid infantry. Danian foot soldier. Redanian foot soldier. Siegfried. Vez. I'll take Vez's card. I'll do a Zoltan Chivoy Chive card too, sure. And Vesemir too. Fine. What else do I got that's shitty? I'll take a Kira card, because I know you probably have that. And um really hope this is recording this time, because if it is not, I'm gonna be pissed off. <laughs> um Uh, I'll take a, I'll take a death mold card, and then we got enough to see. Now you can see in the middle of the area there, I can't circle or anything, but it says number of unit cards, and it says 22. You need at least 22 cards to even play at all. That's including um, all sorts of cards. Your, uh, uh, what is it? It's the um, uh, close combat, the ranged, and the siege. I don't believe hero cards count towards it. Or weather cards, so those ones don't. It doesn't matter how many of these you have. Um, 
more decoys too. Give me more decoys. Although I don't really need. Fuck it. I don't know. Like I said, I'm kind of pissed off that I had to do all this again. I'll grab one more biting frost too. That's it though. All right, now we're gonna play. Cause goddamn it. All right, here we go. Okay, so what do I want to do? I want better cards. Is what I want. At least, at least I got some heroes. Um, fuck this guy and fuck that guy. Where'd I get? Got that one. Okay. Okay, so strategy-wise, uh, he has a Northern Realms deck, which means it's gonna be heavy on on uh, most likely close combat and siege. And possibly spy cards. I have a spy card, I'm gonna use it now. Because that means I get more cards. Even though it gives him points, like it'll see right there, it's gonna give him four points, but it will give me two cards. So it's it's a gamble, which is why it's you know, it's it's a spy. Like it's yeah, I don't know. Anyway. Here we go. He gets four points, but I get what did I get? I got this Trebuchet. Whoop. Oh thanks. See? We have the exact same card. So he's following the exact same, uh, similar pattern as me. So, fudge sticks. I will play. Let's just let's do uh, this one, I guess. Nice. I could scorch him. Maybe I'll wait. Scorch you want to use sparingly because it kills all the cards at a certain level. At the strongest cards on the same... Shit, hold on. It kills, as it says there, discard or playing kills the strongest cards on the battlefield. That includes your side. So if I put it out there now, it would only kill his because he's got 8. But if this was an 8 as well, or if one of these two had 8, it would destroy both of them. So you have to uh, be strategic about playing a Scorch card because you can end up hurting yourself, unless that works out for you, which it rarely does, but sometimes it does. Them more. Like, let's just say, he had a bunch more cards here and they were all eights, and I had one eight. Well, it might get rid of one of my eights, but if it takes care of two or three of his, there's a benefit to that, obviously. So again, you have to worry, think about that sparingly, what that means, so. Um, let's keep this rolling, I guess. Let's do... Let's do Triss's hero card. And hero cards cannot be affected, as it says right there, and not affected by any special cards or abilities. So he can't scorch it, he can't take it, he can't diminish it with weather or anything. So it's just going to stay there. And let's see if he puts more on that row. Which he probably will. Or not, maybe he'll go back there. Um... I want to stop this now. Maybe I'll I could play the same game he's playing. Maybe I'll do this and then use my leader card. Mm -hmm. Although if I do that, I will not be able to use Scorch. Fudge. Okay. Hmm. I might be trapping myself here. I'm already fucking up. Hold on. Let me try this. See what he does. Now, if I do my leader card, it's gonna make my siege uh, units double. I would pass here now, but let's see if he scorches. Yes, he does. Which I kind of thought he would do, but I probably shouldn't have done that. Um, he has five cards left. I've got seven. Hmm. I might... Maybe I'll pass. I could do this. Makes him go one more time at least. Maybe then I'll pass. We'll see what happens. Yeah. That's fine. I'm gonna pass. Yeah. Okay. I'm passing. might play a hero uh, uh, 
supply card, but no, it depends. He only has four cards left, though, so yeah. He's going to get one, because that's the Northern Realms uh, perk. Now, he will probably put out one card, or he might pass entirely. Yes, he passed completely, because he only has a couple cards left, and he knows I have to do something. So I'm going to put out Kira, and I'm going to pass. Now I'll get one card. Hopefully uh, not a shitty one. And it's not a great one, but whatever. My turn! Let's put out Siri. Because the last round means you just go all out. I don't want to save cards anymore. Although you still have to be strategic. Because, like, again, I got this Scorch card here. Oh, you fucker. God damn it. I don't have any fucking decoys. Now he's got one more card than me. I might lose this round. I might lose this game. We'll see what happens. Yeah. Might be in trouble. I will play Vesemir. Hopefully he puts down another... Fuck. Well. You know what? He might have a Biting Frost. I don't know if... I don't want to waste a clear weather if there's no weather here. Damn it, I can't do that because it's going to take... Well, I have to use it now. I'm waiting for him to put down something... A close combat card. So I can get rid of it. But if he doesn't even have one, I'm saving it for no reason. So fuck it, I'll just use it now. That Scorch card would take care of stuff he has in his first row if it was over 10, but... It only works if he's already got it on the board. If I put it down there and then he puts down another close combat card right here, it won't work. Like it won't it won't delete it or anything, so. Fight sticks. Well, I'm going to use the Scorch on the one card he's got back there. Let's see what he's got. He's got three fucking cards left. Fuck, and I probably lost. Fuck it. Let's see. He needs six, seven, seven, seven points to beat me. And he probably will. Let's find out. Nope. Ha, I won by one fucking point. Look at that. Pure luck. That could have gone either way if he had one more card that had more points. So I got real lucky there. I congratulate you on your victory. Shall we continue playing? Yeah, let's continue, I guess. Um, May the best man win. Do you wish to play against any particular factions? Let's do the same level. Let's pl him play. Let's do his monster deck. I'm a witcher, so monsters. As you wish. Would you prefer I use my strongest deck or a weaker one? Let's do your middle of the road because I don't have all my cards out. Hmm. Maybe. A let's go. Come on. Circuit. Come on, goddammit. Um, maybe I'll grab one more. Monster deck means Frost. Because they do a lot of the front loader. And I'll grab a Geralt card too. Well, shit, actually, you know what? Let's grab these idiots. Because I want to muster my own cards. Also, maybe I want... Maybe I want to... Destroys your enemy's strongest siege. Destroys your enemy's ranged. There's any weather. I don't have that card. Where do I get that? I don't even care, honestly. But doubles the strength of my siege. Um. Actually, maybe I will do that. Because they monsters faction a lot of siege. Well, not a lot, but they have siege. Let's do it. Probably still going too fast for you if you're paying attention. Sorry if I am. Fuck this guy. Ugh, I don't have a great deck here. God damn it. Well, whatever. I don't have any fucking spy cards. I am boned. Alright, well. Let's go. Yeah, it is a fiend. Yeah, okay, never mind. I'm talking to myself. 
Um, I'm going to keep going the close combat because that's most likely what he's going to do. Seeing what I can do now, is I can play this one. The Villain Threaten Mirth. Villain Threaten Mirth, something like that. Which it says destroys your enemy's strongest close combat cards, or units, I mean. If the combined strength of all his or her close combat units is 10 or more. And as you can see, it's 12, so it will destroy that entire card as I play it. Boom. Goodbye. And that one only works towards my opponent's deck. Unlike the regular Scorch card over here, me. Speaking of Scorch, I could Scorch this asshole right now if I want. I could wait and see if he puts down more. Let's just be aggressive here. There. Again, if I had an 8 on my row, it would have taken mine too. But I didn't, so. Aha! Perfect. Fucker passed. And I made him waste a Panders Horn, too. Good. That works out for me. Let's see what I get. Something. Ooh, good. That works out for me, too. I wonder if he's got a Scorch. Well, let's try this. That musters all of the same cards I have. See, look. Shit, wrong. Hold on, wait for them to play. Like that, see that same symbol. They have a lot more than me though, shit. <laughs> but that shit, god damn it. I'm messing around. That symbol right there, muster, means uh, it takes any card with the same name or the same uh well I guess the same name, right? Yeah. And it plays it at the same time. As long as it's in your deck anyway. Or on your in your hand that you've got, which is what I dislike. Um, but uh, that's why I like having one of these in my hand and the other two or so in my deck, so when I play it, it plays the rest on the board. Which is helpful. But that's uh, a strong point that monster decks have. Which, by the way, he's only got one card left. Um, I wonder if I should... Maybe I'll wait. I'll, I'll, um, I'll play one... Uh, Hold on. I'll do this. I want to see what that last card he's got is. I know what he's going to do. He is going to do the commander's horn. Hold on. Here, I'll show you. Actually, can I look at his leader card? Strength of all your close. Yeah, so that's, um... I'll bet you right now, after I play my card, he's going to play that. Unless he's got one in his deck right now. He's got one card left and this one. I would bet you... He's going to play this one right now, after I play mine. Let's find out. Which is going to double the strength of his cards. Let's do this and find out what he does. Ah. That's fine. That means I've won, though, too, because he doesn't have anything. He's going to do that at the next round. And then I'll be done. I'll do this. So he's boned. He's going to double it, but it's still not going to be enough. Watch. Oh, he's passed. He can't. He knows he can't win. <laughs> Already over. I can do this if I want to be a dick. It's over. Yeah, that's it. It was actually easier than I thought. That was just again, though. It's just the luck of the card draw. Thanks, buddy. Let's play again. Let's play Scoyatel. Right? Yeah, let's play Scoyatel. Scoyatel. Sound alright? As you wish. Would you prefer I use my strongest deck? Let's go strongest. Feeling lucky today. At your surface. You little fucker. Alright, I'm gonna put all my good cards back in now because I'm tired of playing with weaklings. Gimme. Wait, gimme. Gimme, 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 gimme. Fuck those guys. 
Take the cow too. <laughs> You'll see why if I get it. I'll tell you what it does. It uh, as you see, it's got a point of zero right now. Excuse me. Like I said, when this card is uh, removed from the battlefield, it summons a powerful new card, a new monster or whatever. It's the um, bovine defense force. It's a fiend card, and it's uh, eight points, which is pretty cool for the next round. I mean, you'll see if I get it. If not, then whatever. Okay. Give me that. Give me, oh, I don't want that fucking one. Hold on. All right. I don't need any of these ones, and I don't need... Well, I need my decoy. Well, I'll need two decoys. My plan? Squaytel? Actually, I don't think Squaytel uses a whole lot of um, spy cards, so maybe I won't. I don't need the Biting Frost, either. That's a personal preference, though. I don't like having it cluttering up my deck. I have way too many cards now. Hold on. So I gotta get rid of all these fucking loser cards. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Even you, Vez, you gotta go. Vezimir, too, you gotta go, you're in the way. Clogging things up. Even you, Kira, you're too small. In death mold. Sorry, buddies. Uh, let's see. Get rid of you, you fucker. Shit. Alright, here we go. I don't need two scorches. Okay. And get her back to the one I... Well, actually... Ooh, actually, that might be worth worth it for uh, Squail Tail has a lot of ranged attacks. Destroy your enemy's strongest range. Yeah, I think I'll keep that one. Let's see how that rolls. All right, let's do. That. God damn it! Okay, so I got a decoy, but I don't think I'm gonna need it. So maybe that's one I want to take care of. I have lots of hero cards, which is good. Well, lots. I got three. I've got a spy card, which is good. I don't need this one either. I should have taken this one out. Budge. Okay. Um. I'll keep the decoy just in case. Ah, damn it. Whatever. And as I said before, when I you couldn't fucking hear what I was saying. This is um, it's Dandelion card. It's uh, my, the the mage, well, not the fucking mage, the uh, bard who follows Geralt around, and all the um, character descriptions in the uh, information journal, whatever, are all written by him or him from his point of view. But anyway, he is a uh, commander's horn basically. He's two points. I don't know if you can get that card anywhere else besides Goyatel. I don't know. I'm talking to myself now. Sorry. I'll do this one, as I mentioned before. And see, I don't even remember what it, if it was last time or not, but I like this card with a muster ability, having one in your deck right here, and the rest over in your, what in your hand, and the rest in your unused deck over here. Because when I play it, it'll play all of them. Watch, boom! I like that. That's helpful. But now he'll probably scorch me, or not. Cool. See, this is actually a point where I would have liked Biting Frost, so again, I'm an idiot. <laughs> let's do... Let's do this. It's a, um, a hero card that's also a spy card with zero points, so it puts it on their on their side, but they don't get any points from it, and I get two, two cards, so that's actually a really nice one to have. I think I won this from somebody. You humans have unusual tastes. That's very true. Another spy card. Nice. Oh, he's got one too. Shit, that's nice. 
Get out of my way. What I could do is scorch him right now. In fact... I have to decide now if I want to win this round or not. Because if I give him the, both of these uh, spy cards, it's going to go on his side. Maybe I'll wait. Because if I do this, it's going to make them 8, 8, 8. Which would still be not enough for him to scorch me. See, again, you got to think strategically about this. If I do this now, is it going to hurt me later? I could use the Scorch to kick care of that 12 he's got, but he still has 9 more cards. I doubt he would pass right away. So what I could do... Fuck, I could do that and see if he takes it. Yeah, let's try it. See if he takes it. Ranged combat. Hmm, okay, so he's, just, he's going all out. So maybe I'll throw this round. That's what I'll do. Fuck it. So now I wish I had that other perk. Why did you use that commander's horn? Doesn't make any sense if you're not going to throw any things up there. Well, um, I'm curious what he'll do. I would, I would not like it if he threw down a uh, spy card after I pass, because I won't be able to use my decoy. I don't have any uh, medics or revivals to bring them back, so. Fiddle DD. Maybe I'll put down one more siege just to see what he does. So I'm kind of sacrificing it just to see what else he's got. I'm assuming he might pass, actually. Or not, actually. Damn, alright. Really? Going all out. Alright, now we are done. You know, if he didn't have that 12, if this 12 weren't here, I would scorch him. He would lose all of these. But the 12 being there means if I scorch him, only the 12 will go away. Which wouldn't help me. So... He probably knows that too. <laughs> so I'll pass. That fucker puts down. Well, whatever. Let's just pass and find out what he does. Alright, cool. Well, not cool, because I lost, but... You know, he's got six cards left. He might... Let's see if he passes. No, he's going to keep going, alright. No, I can't pass again, because I lost once already. So that means I have to be a bit more aggressive this round. Without sacrificing. I don't know if he's got a Scorch or not. One, two, three. Actually, I should save that for the last round. Okay, here we go. I'll put down a 10, just to make him keep going, or to give up. Let's see what he does. He might give up. Let's see. No, he's gonna keep going. That's fine, I guess. Let's do... Let's do this. Now he'll pass. Actually, I shouldn't have done that. I wasted it. Well. Look at that, all hero cards, so I can't scorch him. I'm going to have to sacrifice one of my... Uh, siege. So, here we go. Let's 
Let's see what I get. All geared. All right, that's that's fine. Well, actually, it's not that useful to me, but so actually, I'll put Philippa out there first. Just playing along right now. Okay, I actually... My, uh... Leader card uh, destroys your enemy's strongest ranged units, so... At the moment... In fact, maybe I'll just do it now. No, I'll keep going. Let's see what he does. Hmm. I've already won anyway, so. But what I can do, I'll show you what um, this does. If I do that, it'll take care of... That's a Scorch, basically. So now he's got one point. And what I was going to do is do this. And that's pretty cool. I wouldn't use a Scorch now, because that would destroy my cards, but... Um, I didn't even get to use my decoy. Um, and I could do this too, I suppose. Clear weather, if I wanted. But we get the same amount of cards back, so. So yeah, that's it. Cool. All right. I congratulate you on your victory. Thanks, buddy. Let's play one more round. Um. Why don't you play as Nilfgaard? They have a lot of spies. Yeah. Yeah, you be Nilfgaard. As you wish. Would you prefer I use... Strongest. Feeling lucky today. Use your strongest. At your service, sir. Well, At your service. Okay, so now I gotta readjust... Nilfgaard... Well, actually, it doesn't even matter what my leader card is, because Nilfgaard's uh, perk is that they cancel out your leader card. Which is decent, but it's annoying. Um, more decoys. <laughs> in fact, I might want some Biting Frost. Yeah, just in case. I don't need... I don't need you guys, not really. What else do we got here? I don't need Zoltan. Might not need a clear weather. Well, I'll keep it just in case. Just checking here, guys. Hold on. Skellige Storm, actually. Reduces the strength of all ranged and siege units to one. Including mine, obviously. Both sides. Skellige Storm. Um, that could be useful, but I'm not gonna. I don't. I don't like weather cards that much. But um, that's got uh, a use to it. Hold on, let me look around here quickly. Okay. Well, there we go. Let's just let's do this. See, you can't without your leader's card. That's what Nilfgaard always does, because they are dicks. I might keep both of these decoys, actually. Because they have a lot of uh, spy cards, and I have a spy card. Um, the cow, again, is just more of a... It's helpful, but it's not necessary, either. Let's try this. That's helpful. Let's try that. <laughs> I got three. All right, cool. Uh, opponent's turn. Spy card? Damn it. Damn it. I 
can't take that one. Fine. Nice, alright, I'll use this one. Yeah, go ahead, I don't care. They might pass, actually, depending on what they've got. Nope, never mind. <laughs> Fuck, I did probably don't need three of these. Shit. It's only helpful if they've got <laughs> a bunch of uh, spy cards and stuff, so... Um... I guess I could use the... F Fighting Frost. Yeah, fuck it. Now what are you gonna do? Fine. Um... Damn it. I'm gonna have to pass here. To keep going, at least. Ah, finally. Give me that. Ah, you see, I told you they were fucking holding out on me. Ha, ah, perfect. That's fine. Give me that. He might pass now. Nope, he's got more. Alright, that's fine. He can win this round. That's fine. Nice. Another spy card for me. Oh, look at that. All these fucking hero cards. I love it. 46, huh? What about... Two, four, six, eight, ten. Ooh. Uh, doesn't actually help me that much. It'd be thirty six. Trying to think of my str strategy here. I mean, I should just pass probably. If I were to. Actually, have nothing but hero cards here. Besides, I want him to play my card. You know what? I'm just gonna pass. I'm just gonna pass. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. I got that card too. I forgot already. Aha! That works out, I guess. But uh, I would have liked him to have played my card. Um. Yeah, okay, here we go. Nice, and I got a... I got Cyrilla card. Alright, I'm gonna win by default because I got so many... Look at this, I got 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, uh, 84, and 90, 95, 90, 96 points? I might just just sitting right here and not including these two medic cards where I can bring two more cards back. So I mean, unless he's got a, a six more spy cards up his sleeve, and I still have a fucking decoy too. So if he even if he does have spy cards, I can take one. So let's beat the shit out of him right now. <laughs> this is gonna be epic. Ah, here we go. Watch this. I'm taking it. Although, wait. I could wait and see what else he's got. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Maybe I'll just keep playing my cards first. I could take it, but I'll wait. And now he'll take the other one. Yep, he's going to keep doing it now, too. Nice. That's fine. 
I have nothing but hero cards. <laughs> He's got a lot of those, damn. There it is. That's the one I wanted anyway because it's the smallest amount. I don't want to give him more points. I'm glad I waited. Ah, Scorch, that's helpful. It might be helpful, we'll see. Oh, he's scorching me now, well fuck you. Well, that's funny. Because I can do this. And I can use the ones he discourse for me. Ha, thanks, buddy. Watch this. More cards. Another spy. Damn, this is gonna go forever. I don't even think I have any hero cards left. I have them already. <laughs> scorch him yet because that's got he only got one seven um hmm hmm shit what's he got I could scorch him with this Maybe I will, actually. I want to give him more points. Yeah, let's do that. I don't need any more cards. <laughs> back and forth, back and forth. Well, now I can scorch him. Get those sixes out of there. I don't have any sixes on my side, do I? Nope, okay. We're having a showdown here. This is one of the more interesting rounds I've had in a while. I still have four fucking hero cards. Let's go, buddy. Aha. Almost done. He's not out yet, though. Nice. It's not going to help you, buddy. What if I... Got any more scorch? He might. Well, whatever. He's got a 10, though, so he can't do it. <laughs> He's passed, finally. Fuck this guy. Let's go all out. Ah, I can't put it there. Um... Same either way, I suppose. 117 to 52. And you know what? I've seen as high as 300s versus other ones, so this is still not even that bad. But uh, I still whooped him pretty good. That was fun, wasn't it? I sure thought so. Okay. Now, um... Oh, one more round, fine. Like usual, it's addictive. 
So I played... What I played out? I played Northern Realms, Nilfgaard, Squirtle. Let's play Skellige, I suppose. This is only available. Skellige deck is only available in the um, Blood and Wine expansion. So I feel like that's not really fair to play them. Because no one, not everybody's going to have that one. So let's play... Um, let's play Monster deck again, but on a full... Full strength. So monsters. Strong. Feeling lucky today. At your surface, sir. This will be my last round now. Let's. Oh shit! Fuck! Fuck! Shit! Shit! Fuck! Let's get some biting frost in there. Let's get another scorch. And another commander's horn. And then I will change my leader card to. Maybe I'll do the destroys their strongest siege. Yeah. I'll take out these decoys too because they might have one. Fuck it, I don't need them at all. Yeah, let's do this. Alright, here we go. For all the marbles. I will go first, okay. Um, yeah, I'll, well, let's see. Let's see what else I got here. I'll get rid of one of them. Alright, cool. Here we go. I'll put out the cow first, because I want that bovine defense force next round. Let's see what they do here. Uh huh. That's what I grabbed, right? It's, uh... Hey. Hmm. Well, let's see what happens. It's not letting me click it. Destroy your enemy's strongest siege units. Um... Shit, I got nothing but hero cards here. Uh, let's try... Let's do this one. Ah, shit, I shouldn't have done that. If I do end up using the Fighting Frost, it's gonna hurt me. I should've put him on the fucking other lane. Oh well. Huh. Let's do this. Being kinda conservative right now. Well, now I can use it. I'll use my, C my uh, Scorch. See how they're doing. There we go. There's your muster. Hmm. Do I want to play it now? Well, like I said, I do kind of... There's five cards left. How come I can't use my... He has a siege card. Oh, if they're coming... Never mind, if the combination is ten. Never mind, that's why I can't use it yet. I can't read. That's why. Um, I don't really want to use these guys yet. Fuck it, maybe I'll... If I do that, though, he won't put any more on that row. He also might... Well, wait a second. He'll have 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. He'll have 12, and I'll have 2. That would be a bad idea, so I will do this. So you gotta think ahead. If I did that, it would have negatively affected me more than him. Ah. Okay. It also means I just wasted that, because he was going to pass, apparently. Oh well. Cool. Um... I'll pass, actually. You know what? Yeah, I'll pass. Because I got that card out there right now. See what they do. 
Ah, scorching me. Cool, that's fine. Okay. Gonna go all out now. He's got the musty card, gonna bring out more troops. Which... <laughs> fuck you. But I got the... Biting Frost though, so... I should be fine. Even more. Hmm. See how quick this can be one-sided if you don't have a Biting Frost or other Scourges and stuff. They can... Like usual, in typical fashion, monsters can overpower you. Just by having so many cards on that first row. Look at this. <laughs> okay. Let's rain on your parade. And it's so funny, I have enough points now where I could beat him anyway. See, look. Like, I'd beat him without using the Fighting Frost anyway. But I'm gonna do it anyway, just because I'm a dick. And it doesn't affect me, because I have three hero cards that are not affected by weather. See? Not affected by special cards. Yeah, or abilities, which is weather and stuff. Or Scorch. So, fuck you monsters. I'm out. Okay, that's enough. Congratulate you on your victory. Shall we continue, friend? Nope, that's enough, buddy. So, um... Maybe later. Got something I need to do right now. As you wish, sir. So yeah. That's it. That's that's the game of Gwent playing multiple factions and strategies and whatnot in a nutshell. So I hope that was helpful in some fashion. Um if not, then I guess sorry. I'm not really that sorry, but thanks for watching guys. And I will see you around in the uh Witcher universe. I'm in Tucson right now. I don't know if you're in Velen or not, but blah blah blah. Anyway, see you later guys. Thanks for watching.